Setting up Coinbase Wallet on your smartphone. In this video, we'll cover how to create a new wallet using the Coinbase Wallet mobile app, the basics of a recovery phrase, how to claim your free Web3 username, and how to add crypto to your wallet. Let's get you set up with the Coinbase Wallet mobile app. To get started, you'll need to install the Coinbase Wallet app from the App Store or Google Play. Let's create a new wallet. This first step is crucial. This is where you receive the 12-word recovery phrase for your wallet. A recovery phrase is a readable translation of your private key, so you don't have to remember a long set of numbers and letters. Private keys are required for spending, trading, or doing anything else with the crypto in your wallet. It's crucial to protect your private key in the form of your recovery phrase and to never share it with anyone. In other words, anyone who has your recovery phrase has your crypto. We recommend storing your recovery phrase in a secure location, such as a password manager, or writing it down and storing it somewhere safe. Remember, this is the key to access your wallet and Coinbase cannot recover this phrase for you. With the Coinbase Wallet mobile app, you also have the option of backing up your recovery phrase to Google Drive or iCloud. It's important to back up or store your recovery phrase in a secure location because in the event that you lose it, Coinbase will not be able to recover this phrase for you. One last thing about recovery phrases. Coinbase will never ask you for your recovery phrase. If anyone asks you for your recovery phrase, it's best to assume that they do not have your best interest in mind. If you choose to back up manually, there will be a quick test to confirm you stored your recovery phrase. Then you'll be asked to choose an additional security layer for your wallet, either biometrics or a passcode. Choose your preferred method, agree to the terms of service, and then proceed to the next step. Now we're getting to the fun part, choosing a username. This username is powered by the Ethereum Naming Service, or ENS, and serves as a Web3 address that makes it easier to send and receive crypto. Heads up, you can skip this step for now, but you will not be able to change your username once you create it. If you want others to be able to find your wallet, simply check the box. If you already have an existing .eth or ENS address, you can choose to use that by following the instructions. Once you're ready to move forward, click Submit. Last but not least, before you can use your wallet to collect NFTs, participate in DeFi, or just explore Web3, you'll need to add some crypto to your wallet. You can tap the Buy button to easily add crypto that you already hold in a Coinbase account or buy crypto from fiat and supported countries using Coinbase Pay. You can also transfer crypto from another self-custody wallet using your new wallet's address or username. Now you're ready to explore the world of crypto. Make sure to check out our other videos and articles to help you get started with Coinbase Wallet.